What's going on today, YouTube? How are we all doing? We're gonna keep this one short and sweet today. It is the 352 formation guide Thursday. I know we do these on Fridays, but we're doing one on Thursday today. Uh, so we're gonna get straight into it. 352 custom tactics. Simple. Uh, 352, we're gonna go to the instructions. Um, basically, I know a lot of you people out there asking me how to set up with this. So basically, I have my best defensive fullback uh, and my two center backs is my back three. Uh, I have uh, Alex Tellez, who's a, a good attacking fullback. So I have him up the left uh, left wing back. And Gabriel Jesus, who's just kind of a body on the right, really. He just kind of serves a pur just a purpose of being there, really. Uh, and that is about it. Two defensive mid, center attacking mid, two strikers. Simple as that. Uh, onto the instructions. Uh, Rashford, Neymar. With every two striker formation, you're going to want to have um, one that gets in behind uh, and one that stays forward, or one that gets in behind and one that stays back in the midfield a little bit. Uh, so, right, this is a bit of a difficult situation. So, Neymar's got the higher pass rating and it moves a little bit more quicker, and Rashford um, is going to be a bit slower uh, and a bit less agile. So, it depends on really what you want to do if you want Rashford making the runs or Neymar making the runs, depending on how you how you set up and who you, who you have as your two strikers, really. Uh, it depends on that, but you want to have one of these two set to get in behind and the other set to uh, the target man. Simple as that. Uh, both are going to set to be or be set to balanced with normal interceptions and basic defensive support. We don't really want them getting back too much, but, uh, you know, dropping back a little bit. Uh, Bruno Fernandez is your cam. Who are your cam? Is come back in defense. Uh, everything else presents the default. Uh, aggressive interceptions, uh, so he does clog passing wins a bit more, but... Uh, Default, default, uh, come back on defense. This is going to be a very simple formation, guys. If you couldn't already tell by the start of this, it's going to be very, very simple. Uh, Alex Tellis, come back on defense, and everything else is set to default. Um, this is going to be a formation where you dominate the possession. You dominate the entire game. Um, more often than not, you're going to dominate the uh, the shots. Oh, I thought that was my PlayStation entry. Um, we're going to be dominating the entire possession, uh, and the shots on target. Everything about the game is going to be dominated by you. Um, so you're going to have your, uh, both your wing backs set to come back on defense and everything else default. Uh, you want them occupying that entire space in left and right. Uh, and your two defensive midfielders, you want to, uh, cut passing lanes, stay back while attacking, uh, default. And then this is the most important thing in this entire video, guys. If you take one thing from this video and implement it in any other 352 formation guide that you watch, it is to cover center. You need your two defensive midfielders. In my case, it is Paulinho and Allen. You want them both set to cover center. Uh, one of the things that I've been toying with, uh, Paulinho is my more box-to-box, -box, uh, but Allen is the defensive midfielder. Um, I have been setting the, uh, my box-to-box -to, -box to balanced and setting my defensive midfielder to stay back while attacking, but I'm going to show you guys some game footage, and you'll see that you really don't need to do that. If you're dominating possession, your center defensive mids will tend to creep up the pitch anyways, and you don't really need to have them set to be anything other than stay back while attacking. It's just going to prevent you from getting counterattacked a bit more. Uh, center backs, everything good to go there. It's a really simple formation, guys. It's not as difficult as you would think. So I'm going to get you guys into some gameplay. But before I show you guys the gameplay, again, I thought that was my PS5 Q line. For those of you watching this video and you are on PlayStation, even Xbox, and you are waiting in a queue or anything to do with PlayStation, best of luck to you. Because I have struck out five times on PlayStation releases. So... Best of luck to you. Anyways, into the video. Make sure that you watch the next two or three minutes, whatever the gameplay is, because it is the most second most important part of the video, with the first part being the cover center on the two defensive midfielders. Basically, with this formation, you are going to be passing around the box uh, with Rashford, Neymar, Bruno, your two strikers, and Cam. Uh, and then your wingbacks are going to be occupying the space. Um, basically, anywhere outside the left and right of the 18-yard box. Basically, that entire area. Uh, your two defensive mids are just going to kind of drop in a little bit and provide you outlets. Uh, I'll show you in the gameplay and I'll point it out. Um, and I'll point out all these things and I'll tell you exactly how you have to play offensively with this. Like I mentioned, this is going to be a possession or a formation where you dominate the possession. So I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. Just I'm going to stop talking and get you guys into some gameplay so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, so we're going to start this attack from the back. Uh, we'll just counter-attack and dealt with it fairly easily. So I'm going to show you guys how to basically build up with this. So we've got Gabriel Jesus, who plays off the wing for me. Um, he drops back in a really good position. Uh, Allen kind of um, occupies any space we need him to. Same with the defensive midfielders. And we're not going to press this forward. Um, a bit of a question on one from uh, Joe Gomez there. But basically, there, there's no rush. It's a, whole, it's a really patient formation. 
Um, two defensive mids getting really good spaces. Uh, so let's see if I can get this into a bit of a more attacking position here. So I've got the width out wide provided by the two uh, wing backs, which are Gabriel Jesus and uh, Alex Tellez. Uh, and you've got Neymar dropping into the space, which is nice there. Uh, and you've got runners going off, so obviously that wasn't the best of passes, but we've got Tellez running off him. Uh, so, I mean, he's, he's just creating an opportunity for himself there. We'll stop this counterattack relatively easily because he's got a Domitra ARA who literally is just in nothing but pace merchant. I think Usain Bolt would do the same exact job that he does. Um, so we're going to work this out of the back again. Uh, it, it's, it's relatively easy. The way this formation is set up, there's a lot of guys that get into a lot of good positions. Uh, R1 dribbling is crucial. Uh, you can counterattack fairly easily with this formation. Um, it's, it's, you get a lot of guys running in good positions. Like I said, this is a very, very easy formation to use and doesn't get enough credit for being really friendly. Cause you see a three at the back and you don't think it's as defensive, but I promise you it's just as defensive, if not more than your standard four, two, three, one. So just like that, Neymar's in the space. We've kind of worked a little bit. R1 dribbling around the box. He's got Baron, so there's really not much I'm going to be able to do with that. Uh, and we're going to find Neymar who's going to slot one home. It's just like that guys. You're going to pass it around the box. You're going to be super patient. Uh, and it's, it's that easy. You're gonna be super patient, really, and we're gonna get this guy doing a glitch and messing it up. So, guys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you smash the uh, subscribe button, leave a like on the video, we're gonna get this guy to rage quit, hopefully by the end of the video here. Um, make sure you check out my other videos. I do formation guides. I try to every Friday, sometimes twice a week. This week will be twice a week because obviously we're going to have uh, this video coming out on Thursday uh, when you watch this and another one coming out on uh, Friday. We're going to be doing a park the bus tactic uh, as a request from some viewers. So um, yeah, like I said, make sure you smash a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment. Let me know what formation you play in game. And if you play the 352, let me know how you've got on. If uh, you play it in foot champs, where do you normally finish? We're going to get this guy to rage quit. Oh, maybe not. Uh, and I'm going to fast forward this until we get this guy to rage quit. Let's see what this does right here. And like I said, we're going to dominate possession in this game. And it's not like we're playing overly possessive. In the first five, ten minutes of the game, I didn't touch the ball. Uh, so we're dominating 70% of the possession right there. So it's as easy as that, guys. All you have to do is be patient. Wait for the pass to present itself. Wait for your strikers to make the runs. Guys, I promise it's going to happen. I'm going to fast forward until this guy quit or win the game. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Peace, fellas.